Hello and welcome to our next video. In this lesson, we're going to continue where we left off last time after we finished wiring up our bundle config. We're going to move to the layout.cshtml and we're going to get our page wired up correctly to render the scripts and CSS files correctly. And we'll run the application and see it working. So here we go. So all the way down here on views under shared is layout.cshtml. This is a layout that's shared. You can see styles rendering is content CSS and then this bundles mo modernizer, we don't have anymore. So we're gonna take that one out. And then down here at the bottom, we have our bundles jQuery, our bundles bootstrap, and we need a bundles for data tables as well. And we kept it all small lowercase. So we'll just do data tables. And that will wire up our page. I'm gonna go ahead and hit F5 and see if it's gonna work at this point. And this will take a moment to build and load. All right, so we have it loaded up. It doesn't look like my theme is wired correctly. Let's see if we have JavaScript. It does look like we have a little bit of our theme there. Our JavaScript is working. We have the ability to do that. And so our bootstrap and our JavaScript is working, but our nav bar doesn't look quite like what I'd like it to look like. So what I want to do is quickly go back into my bundle config. I'll need to stop my project to do this uh, because once I change the code, it's going to have to be changed. And I think what I want to do is take out the bootstrap theme CSS altogether. I think that's overwriting my change here. And so I want to do this. I maybe could have tried to put it over top uh, on the other side. And the other thing I want to do is I know that this is going to come back incorrectly on the nav bar. It's going to look brighter than I want it to. So I'm going to change this to nav bar default. And that's just a different rendering of the nav bar and the style. So I'm going to hit F5 again. And hopefully now our page will look like it should look with the flatly theme and everything should be wired up and working as far as we can tell at this point. We may need to fix stuff later. We'll see as we hit things. And if you saw that I made a typo or something, obviously don't just copy it, make yours work right away. I'll find mine eventually. <laughs> All right, and so there you have it. We have our theme wired up correctly. So we had it working, everything's working. Let's just make sure our JavaScript and Bootstrap still looks like they're working correctly, and they are. And so that wraps up our getting our pages ready to go with all of the JavaScript, CSS, and Bootstrap, and all that jQuery and everything that we need for our project. So thank you very much, and we'll see you next time.